Hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel, Sylvia and Corey Bichanga. As you might notice, the background is different. There's Nicole Addy, go subscribe to her channel, give her some love. So guys, something happened this morning. It seems every day we kind of have a monumental thing happen. Either we, you know, have an accident or casually break a thumb or, um, <laughs> so, the casualty of today, <laughs> that sounds very bad, but the mishap of today is that we woke up thinking tomorrow morning, Saturday morning is our checkout. We woke up to a message on Airbnb saying, just a reminder, you have to check out by 10 a.m. today. When I read that message, it was 1 p.m. We had already overstayed Kabisa. So we just got up packed and threw everything into bags headed over here to a new airbnb we just booked because honestly the other one we were not feeling the vibe it was dark there it was, was it was not giving <laughs> the it was dark and the windows there was no natural light coming in the windows were inside a building facing other apartments there was no natural light in the room we just felt trapped in there so we got this better room just down the road about 15 minutes drive and so we just unloaded everything can you see the mess in here we just plopped everything here and we are rushing because today we were going to take you guys to china square is it called china square yeah china square it's a huge store like a target or something is what i hear it has everything at very cheap prices. It's like China brought their products and they're selling them at wholesale, wholesale prices. So it's not going through second and third parties to sell the products, but they're originally like directly from China. So we wanted to do a vlog there and her cousin, um, Bill offered to drive us. So we need to head on over pick him up and let him drive us as we edit our videos for you guys for tonight i'm just from crying my <laughs> thumb is very painful honestly her dislocated thumb is really paining her today she was she shedding was crying she was shedding tears so not everything is all ponies and rainbows in yes. this time but we are strong women we will push through and things shall be fine hallelujah amen, amen. so Let's go and pick up Bill and let's go because it's already late. As That's you guys exactly. know, all our vlogs, we say that, but it's really late today. We have today to go. Late. Today it's like three. Yeah. Okay, this is our usual time, but <laughs> And the, the mall place is like probably 30 minutes or 45 minutes away. So yeah. we really need to get moving. So let's go pick up Bill and let's go to China Square. Woohoo! I love you. Give you everything you want me to Think about it If I could I'd burn down the moon And give that to Are here at China Square. 
It's kind of a controversial store, isn't it? Yeah. It's a bit controversial. So, I think we are heading inside right now to see what they have. So, let's go check it out. So guys, I'm thinking today might be the perfect time to buy something for Cory while I'm on this trip. I saw some of you in the comments were asking, what are you gonna buy for Cory? So I saw these helmets and I know he just had a picky accident and that picky really scares me. Oh, I don't like that picky, but I'm thinking about buying him a helmet here. But I don't know if it goes like different sizes not sure but i think i might buy him a helmet here so guys we are still here at china square is it an hour later no it's like two hours 30 minutes later what and our cart keeps on getting fuller and fuller so i think i chose this helmet for cory i didn't want to get too much of a cheap one because i want it to be strong so I think this will suit him. Yeah. It looks like Corey. Looks let's, like him. He let's hope like it's, a bike and let's hope it's his size. I think helmets are one size fits all. But yeah, hope he likes it. We have broken the bank. We gave China Square all our money. That Take all our money. Broke until further notice. The good thing is, 
we've already paid our Airbnb yeah. and we threw out the car so yeah. um, that's the good thing. We kind of just need to get food from now on. <laughs> no, but I'm still good but it's like you come in here and you feel like I don't really need that much and then you just spend $150 and contemplate your life choices. Yep. There was so much more I wanted to video. They have a kitchen section, baby section, furniture. Um, I just couldn't get everything on the video, but stay tuned at the end of today's video for a haul as to everything I bought here. Waking up to my heartbeat, accompanied by the rain. Soreness in my eyes is not very surprising. This room is still uncharted, but as soon as I get started, I'll send you in a so, so, guys, Nicole's cousin um, is taking us to a new restaurant for supper, so let's go have some supper. I'll send you in a so I'll wait like it's nobody's business Give me some time to breathe Give me some time to speak Cause I know the truth inside And I promise you this time No more vow No more strange stupid games Just one bottle No more pain All in vain Let your guard down So guys it's the most wonderful time of the video. And guess what? Right now I'm going to give you a haul of China Square. So let's get into what did I buy at China Square? First up, I bought my husband a helmet for when he rides the picky because I still need him around. And let me bring this bag up here. Ah, so many goodies. I got this um, shower curtain um, for an upcoming project that I'm doing. You guys stay tuned, not at my house. Um, here is a holder for like my mops, um, broom handles, all that jazz. And let me see, oh, I have a receipt here. So I can give you guys a little bit of the pricing or is that gonna to take too long? That's gonna to take too long, okay. Um, moving on, I got this cute little purse. It goes good with the taupe shoes that I got. Um, I think it was like four or 4.50, something like that. And then I got these for three something. Um, for my entryway. The reveal is coming up soon, so you guys stay tuned. Um, let me see, what else? These were from today. Um, they're literally just underwear, so y'all didn't miss anything. Um, here I got a mirror. I think this was like five or six dollars, but um, to put on the door where I usually stand in front of my closet door. And so I wanna um, use double-sided tape and put this mirror um, there to do my makeup. So I got that. And then I got this fake plant. I think I'll have to pull around on the leaves a little bit to make it look better. But got one of these for like $6 something. And then I got, I, I'm going to try fake eyelashes. My mom is going to die laughing when she sees this. But um, sometimes for like really dressed up special occasions, let's say an anniversary dinner or something like that, Valentine's, I would love to pop on a pair of lashes, you know, just in case I need to fly away or something. Um, so I bought these. <laughs> um, very, very cheap, like less than a dollar. Um, I got a foaming facial wash vegan um it was like five bucks and i got a uh, makeup spray like uh, setting spray it was like two or three bucks and i got cbd 
um, hemp dream primer and it was also like three four dollars and then I got a lip gloss and probably one 110 106 something like that for this and then I got this long runner for in my hallway um, it kind of has the colors of the basket that is hanging for the shan the, not the chandelier but the the light shade in my hallway so it kind of vibes with that so i got this nice runner i hope the size looks okay in the hall um i wasn't able to really measure it but i just kind of measured it with my eyes and hope for the best and then last but not least i got a basket i am a sucker for a cute basket and you guys you guys I want to put like um one of my snake plants in here and i think this basket was let me see i think that was one of the first ones on the list the storage basket was twenty dollars so that's a wrap that's what i got for fifteen thousand shillings or 150 usd approximately difference with the currency exchange so i hope you enjoyed that haul Thanks so much for watching today's video and I will catch you guys on the next vlog. Bye guys. One thing's true. I never asked for none.